What's up, Cloud Racer? This is Dr. Cloud here. Welcome to a new series on the channel. Uh, this is going to be a Pokemon Yellow, as you can see, um, and we're going to be doing a solo, basically speed run, um, as a part of a competition that I have uh, joined. As you can see on the layout it is called the Pokemon Nuzlocke Championship Games and uh, I've got a timer on the layout because I can only go for 20 minutes once I hit the new game button and per episode so this one's slightly longer so I can introduce myself for anyone new coming and also why I am doing this challenge okay so we're gonna hit the new game button in three, two, one. So I might not have the best commentary through this because I am uh, trying to go as fast as I possibly can. Um, I do want to kind of at least name myself. I don't want to do like a complete like speed speed run because I'm not that worried about it really. Um, and I like having the rival as Gary because it's just way more fun. Uh, I am watching different like speed runs to make sure that I'm going as fast as possible in this game since I have never tried to do a solo run. I don't even know if I actually grabbed that potion. Um, yeah, I did. So I'm just super worried about messing this up right now, to be honest. Because, like, it it's so easy to mess up little things in this game. So I'm pretty much going to try to follow what I generally know about the game. And... Since I can do a solo run, so I'm only going to be using the Pikachu, and, um... Man, I've got more to say. Um, I can catch HM Pokemon, so I can, you know, travel around the region and such. But, um, outside of that, I'm not allowed to catch anything else. Um, I still can't use those Mon in battle. So... That'll be interesting. Um, if I lose, though, like if I lose against a wild Pokemon, I think I lose 5 points of the 100 points I start with. And if I lose against a um, Trainer Mon, I lose 10 points. And you can also receive... Um, I should nickname the Pikachu, a shorter name. Um, you can also gain points by um, beating the gym first between all the rest of your competitors, which I think there's like 12 other competitors in this competition. And hopefully I'll be able to like share around like who these people are. I got a crit on that first turn, that was actually really nice. Um, I'm also not allowed to use speed up. Um, there's not really much more. Alright, I so I won that first battle. That's actually really nice. Okay, we're only three minutes in, so I think I'm doing pretty good. I'm honestly not 100% though, to be honest. What I will say though is uh, thank you to the uh, YouTuber named Dragonstorm for putting this competition to competition together and allowing me to join in it. That's definitely an important person right there. Man, I really do not want to see the Rattata. It's just, um, 
As far as I know, it's the thing that gives you like the least amount of possible experience is a level 2 Rattata. And you really want to see like Pidgeys, like I think level 4 Pidgeys are probably the best thing you can see on this route. That's not level 2, isn't it? Yep. Man, I bet if I was level 7 I could uh, kill them in one shot. I'm getting lucky that they're not tackling me, because um, I might not have to worry about healing immediately. Because I think uh, I'm going to get this parcel, which should help a lot. We got in the last patch. Alright, come on, give me that Pidgey. Yes, okay, this is level 4. Level 3, that's still fine, that's good. Um... My goal really is to at least get to Brock in this first episode. That's probably my biggest thing right now. If I can get to Brock in this first episode, then that'll be big for me. I went the wrong way. I'm gargling. I don't know if you're allowed to uh, buy potions already from that guy, but I'm just not gonna worry about talking to him right now. I can buy them later. Oh, gosh, the guy moved on me. Come on. Man, you never get any encounters on your way back. That's crazy. Because I actually wanted to get the encounters, like a Pidgey or something. Okay. We're almost at six minutes, and we've gotten the parcel back to Oak. I think that's pretty decent. Although, honestly, I'm not sure. I don't know, it's actually considered decent. He said on the desk. He didn't even walk over to the desk. Come on. Man, he walks so slow. I know there are certain speed things I can do um, that would make me go even faster right now, but I just don't really know them. Or I don't know how to do them, I guess. Or why you would do them. Like, um, I think some people like will talk to Oak from behind and I don't really get why you do that. Ooh, nice. Gosh. If I can get to level 7 before I hit Viridian, that would be super ideal. I think all I need is like one, maybe two more Pidgeys. Nope, it's not happening. Come on. Come on. There we go. Come on, give me that level 4 Pidgey. Okay. Oh, level 6? Oh, yes. I definitely can't kill this in one Thundershock, but, like, that's big experience. That's fine. I have to heal anyways. Ooh, crit me. It's fine, though. Yes, there's level 7. It's perfect. to heal up that PP or else I'm not gonna be able to make it through the forest here. Um, I probably need to grab more potions as well. Okay. So I'm not gonna be able to beat Brock without a little more potions. thought it'd tell me if I went over money. It doesn't do that in this game. If I had done the money amount, I could have just, like, hit over to the right, and it would have done it for me. <laughs> and then you 
just fails to catch a Rattata, which is kind of sad. Okay, we're almost at the 10 minute mark. I don't know if I'm able to make it through the forest, though. Then he has to walk away, which also takes forever. Come on. And my game's like doing weird stuff, I feel like. There it goes. Now it's doing normal. Okay, we fight this girl. Her, her Nidorans give like a bunch of experience. If I could crit this thing, that would be great. Nope, that's definitely not a crit. It's fine, if you keep growling me, I'd love it. That is a crit, okay. Oh, and it got paralyzed? Okay, okay. Okay, it still has to tackle, that's kind of sad. Since that's a meter and mail. Okay, okay. It's not what I want to see. Oh, another crit? Okay. I see you, Pikachu. I see you. Alright, does that get me to level 8? Ah, oh, it didn't get me to level 8. I must be off on experience just barely. Oh shoot, that's not a trainer. Ah, oh, dang it. It takes him so long to walk over to me. Should've just gone in the grass. I really need to find like some Metapods or maybe like a Pidgey, Pidgeotto in the grass. It's actually kind of lucky to hit that paralysis. Maybe he'll just get paralyzed for a round. The pants of late. Okay, can I two shot these things now, maybe? I think I will roll that last one. Oh man. I really hope I can randomly run into a high level Pidgey or something like that. Pretty sure these are gonna be three shots. Oh man, I got the paralysis again. I'm getting that a lot. I don't know if those Caterpies were higher levels or not, but they certainly didn't take those Thunder Shocks, or the Metapods didn't take them as well. Okay, level nine now. I should definitely two shot the Caterpie. Yes, definitely. Doing pretty well right now. Actually, might not even have to use a potion through here if we keep doing pretty well. Another Metapod, that's good experience. Nice. Okay. 
No, I can't. I'm worried about my PP. No. Oh no, I should have moved one before that. Sign we can ooh, can I two shot a level eight caterpie? Ooh, yeah I can, especially with that crit. What I really want to see is like just that Pidgeotto encounter. Pidgeotto would be perfect right now for me. Ooh, double crit, dang. Pikachu is killing it right now. This is definitely gonna be level 10 right here. Ooh. I actually thought I was gonna two shot it. If I would have critted, I would have. I had the paralysis though. Nice. Didn't have to wait for him to do his animation. Yep, there's level 10. Okay, Pidgeotto encounter. Nope. That's just not gonna get me the experience I need. And I know I need like at least four Thundershocks to beat the last battle, I think. Oh, yeah. And I can't face the first gem without a uh, quick attack, and I need to hit level 11 to get that. Okay, okay. Give me something good. Yes, okay. Good level. Eight, yes. Okay. I think this might give it to me. Yes, one shot. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, I might... No. I really hope this just doesn't bite me in the butt. I don't know the exact math for uh, how much experience each battle gives. Okay, he only has one. Is it just a Caterpie, level 10? I don't know if this is going to give me enough experience. I know I can't. Yeah, it's a three shot actually. So I need four, I need three. Okay, you got paralyzed. Okay, I've got three Thundershocks left after this. Yep, I need one more encounter. One more decent encounter. Come on. Okay. Come on. Yes! Come on. Give me that experience. There's level 11. You gotta be really careful with these older games and the way your moves are. Because if you accidentally forget, like, Thundershock, then you run's over. by the Pokemon Center. I don't know if I'm able to beat Brock before the 20 minute mark. It'll be close. Yeah, in reality, I really should have been a timer rather than counting up. That would have made more sense. So I've only got a minute and a half. So I can definitely get into the battle with Brock, but I don't think I can beat him. Okay, I've got a minute, so I might take out his Geo dude, basically. I 
growl it, lower its attack. Done. Tail whips. There's one. No, I'm not gonna take out this Geo Dude. Two. Nice. Okay, I've got 10 seconds and I'm definitely not going to take it out, so I'm just going to have to take my hands off the controller as soon as that hits the 20 minute mark. And... now. Okay. Alright. Um... I gotta remember to stop it. Okay. Um, so. Uh, this will be picked up in the next uh, episode, I guess, that'll be uploaded. Um, I'm not sure exactly when, because it's going to go by how the competition is. But uh, I will see you guys next time, and I guess root for me to win.